What's poppin' homies, it's your boy Frank Nitty back in the building outside the Nike factory store. As always, today we at Celebration. It's been a good, good minute since I've been here. Um, this is my Nike outlet of 2020. When Florida reopened, this was the go-to spot. You know what I mean? I found Supreme Jackets, uh, Bread 4s, Nostalgia 4s, Denim 6s, Animal Instincts 3s, Air Jordan 1, Air Jordan 1 Mids. Air Max 97, Air Max 98, the list goes on and on. But anyways, we're here today. We're about to go inside and see what's popping, and I'm bringing you guys along with me, man. So I'll see y'all inside. Peace. Yo, this spot is really, really busy, man. I see a lot of people coming out with bags. I thought eventually they were going to start letting people in, man. Just how many people have been pulling up, walking inside. But there's no line. There is an employee outside, but it looks like they're not at capacity. But it looks like it from a distance, though, man. Crazy amount of people going in and out of this spot. All right, kids spring sales up to 50% off select items. Okay. So I found a Jordan out, man. Bozai. As soon as I pulled up, went to the first eyes I always do. And I found these Air Jordan 35s, man. Only like two pairs left because this is the this is the transformer box, right? So this is the 35s, and then you swing over here, you got the 34 lows. They're going for 129. Seen the same. I see them for the same price at uh, the Nike, Nike Outlet International. A few sizes left. The thing is, you gotta get down real low to see your size, man. Size 12s, there we go. Size 12 in these joints. Uh, one, 130. And then I almost rocked these today. Literally, lightweight. Almost bust these out. But your boy bust out Air Jordan 1 top threes. A um, few sizes in those, size 12. And these going for retail game, 165, man. Pull up if you want them. 234 lows and 135 high. I'm not sure what these are, man. The hint for 34. If y'all care for them, I like the colorway, but not the shoe. This almost got me, man. I thought this was another retro, but it's not. You got the Delta joints for 100 beans. Yeah, right. These Odell Beckhams? Nah, the 270s, right? Yep, Aerospace 270s for 140. Did I say that right? 140? Nah, 150. Your Jordan 1 joints. But these are the higher reacts, though, for 119. Not a fan. All right, we got the BB neck for 119. Two started growing on me. It actually has grown on me. Um, I have tried them on, they're very comfortable. I clearly won't pay that price for this colorway because it's a white colorway. And if you play ball in it, you already know what's gonna happen. It's gonna get dirty stupid quick. We got the PG's fours right next to them. TB, team basketball for 70. We're passing. We also got these Kyrie Lowe's and a red box for 90. Are these Kyrie Lowe's? Now these are fly traps for 60. Moving on, more fly traps. Be careful them for 65. This look like it's another fly trap, fly trap threes. Now let me know if you guys have rock these to play ball in and if so how comfortable or not comfortable these are they do have nike zoom on them so they look like they put a little bit of tech in them but that's 65 another one 65 as well kobe kobe fairy i'm uh, going for retail hundred dollars multiple sizes and those then you also got the cool gray kd 13 team basketball though 109 is the price multiple sizes now nah, i don't know if 109 is a good price for this shoe but they're cool though i like them and here's another KD 13 team basketball, but it's in white. And ironically, they only got two sizes left, nine and a nine and a half, but they're going for $100 though. Now, I don't know if they had any additional discounts, but look at the shelf, bro. Clear out, man. Joints are gone. Moving along. He got some Kyrie AIs. I used to call that glow in the dark shoe, but it's, it doesn't glow in the dark. They're going for 109 though. But over here, it's another AI joint. Why is it called AI? I don't know. Kyrie 6, 70 beans, not a bad price. Not a bad price. And there's another Kyrie 6, this would be the Ossidian, right? White Navy, a white Midnight Navy joint. They're going for 130 though. Care for them, man. Get yourself some Kyrie's. I actually like this colorway. I actually like that colorway. Uh-oh, we're in the LeBron territory. 160 for these joints. I don't remember seeing the black pair in the outlet. I could be wrong though. Fruity Pebble joints for 160 as well. Multiple colors. And then the black and purple joint for, for 160 as well. Oh, they still got these joints. Last time I was here, man, I remember conversing with a guy. He was like so stoked to get these, man. He's like, yo, gotta get them. <laughs> I'm like, all right. Do your thing. Ah, right, we passing. He's going for 40. We passing. More D breaks. More D break. Look at the cross trend low. All black joint. Pass. More LeBrons. But they're going for the same price, 160. Then we pull up on the soldier joints for 100. 100 for the witness. Wow. They're putting a zoom unit in the forefoot on every shoe, man. Why is this LeBron witness has that same zoom in the forefoot? 
I'm tripping. Oh, I, I guess they're doing it for every shoe because I see this shoe almost like every single time in the outlet, but I never notice it. Wow. So they're putting a little tech in these uh, non-signature shoes. And you got the black joint. You got the old witness joint for 80. And then you got the free twos for 75. Not fan this colorway. I actually like the black and purple colorway. And then another Mama Kobe shoe. These joints are here for 100 if you care to know. All white and gray. Multiple sizes. The only shoe remotely interested in this aisle is these joints for 70 beans. These are the React Prestos and that uh, laser crimson metallic silver colorway. They're cool. I know they're comfortable, man. I know they're comfortable. Multiple sizes in those. Keeping it moving. Like I said, this supposed to be the Zoom Pulse. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what this is about, man. Who's rocking this shoe? I know they don't got no laces. Just stick your feet in there. Almost like a slip or a slide. Those are going for 85. Passing on those. We passing. We're passing as well. We do got this blazer though for 60 beans. We see this in every outlet though. So features on. Got the orange, light orange, old school boxes for 60. What up? This is completely gone. Nothing, nothing on this shelf right here. What used to be here? Is this even? Okay, that's in the next aisle. A React Presto Fly Net for 70. Which one is this? Okay, we've seen these everywhere. We've seen this in a lot of outlets. The price is coming down. I'm gonna help y'all out and stick that right there. I remember clowning these shoes because the boxes, man, this is a size 12 and this is a size 10. Look how, look how uh, big the, the bottom box compared to the, the box above it. Keeping it moving, React Vision's in the black, React Vision in the white, React Vision in the photo blue, and the React Vision in the summit white. They got two rows of these joints. Those are going for 80 if y'all interested. Wow, they got a whole bunch of these Air Jordan 1 React joints, man. Size 10, what size is this? Another 10, they're going for 119. On feet, we got the Air Jordan 1 top three. Now these shoes came out November 28, 2016 for $160. I copped these day one downtown at the Trophy Room pop-up shop. I remember nobody wanted this shoe. Everyone decided to pass. There was a few of us. We were considered an outcast. We were considered hype beasts. We were considered everything but the person who actually cared for the shoe. Now, everybody want this shoe. Everybody regret not buying it. The prices went up. They were started at around 250. Then it went to 350, 400. Now, if you want this shoe, you gotta pay upwards to $700. And I rock these shoes a handful of time. No more than five, no less than three. But I love these shoes. Cop them day one. One of my favorite shoes in the collection. Bread on the toe box, raw ones on the left shoe. Dope, 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 dope. Anyways, dope shoe. Going on five years old. How many of y'all bought this day one? How many of y'all appreciate this shoe before it released? And how many of y'all pay retail to get this shoe? I feel sorry for those who are buying this shoe for resale because the numbers are crazy. The numbers are silly crazy. Air Force One, GTX, in other words, Vortex, the 109. That's showing up, let me hope y'all out. What else? This joint is huge as hell, size 15, if y'all care for it. 135 is the price. Then you got this canvas joint, Air Force One, 07, multiple pairs of those. And also the Black History Month joints, we pass it hard. Nike Space Hippies 04s. Who's buying these? Recyclable joint. 70 for it. 70 for it. 70 for it. But we passing on these joints anyway. Get yourself some all black Air Force One Miz, y'all. Actually, my last video, yeah. Who rock Air Force One Miz? I know a lot of people go for the, the white pairs, but who rock the black joint? These are 95. B grade on the box. Y'all know that really means anything. Now, this is different, man. This is supposed to be like a Christmas Air Force One. The Air Force One High 07 LV8. Going for retail gang. 125. Multiple pairs available in that. First time i've seen this shoe got the fur for the lining that's unique i'm not a fan of straps so i'll pull that right off and the laces is flat i'm still passing vortex joint for 130. we've seen this everywhere man actually one of my throwback videos man i saw one of these joints well, not a line it was a duck boot i'm moving on and a whole bunch of blazers air max Isle. air vapor max 2020 fly knit for 220 dollars only bigger size left 10 and a half 13 and 14. I like this colorway. Now I like this colorway as well. This is all red joint. Also is a uh, fly knits. Did I said net. I apologize. I mean fly knit. Air Vapor Max 
2020 fly knit for 160 multiple sizes and those size 11 is the biggest i see though oh and you got the old school vapor max but it can't be old school because this is a vapor max fly knit three this is like a metallic let me see if i'm right yep white pure platinum i'm sorry platinum not metallic i meant to say platinum keeping it moving air max 270 reacts and there's three rows of these if you care for them then swing over here man look at this just empty nothing on the shelves man what is this air max 200 for 100 you already know prices is going back up on these another black and white joint going for 100 there's two rows of those this one is 60 a uh, black and white joint all right let's bend the corner see what else is popping before we get out of here okay air max one lv8 joint I like that navy colorway man it's white obsidian wolf freight and black is that right where's the black oh on the outsole they're crazy don't have my size that I acquired by them earlier. They got size 14 and 15, so they got big sizes. And peep this 95, yeah. I like this as well. Um, 119 is the price. Small sizes, size seven. That sucks, man. Air Max 270 for 109. I feel like this one came out like two years ago, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, 109 is the price, a few sizes left in those. And then you got the 2090 joints right here. It's not my favorite colorway, but here you go. 90 beans, a few sizes left. Then you got that USA colorway for 90 as well. A lot of sizes on those. And then the TM joints. TM Air for 80. Different boxes. Uh, TM Air NX CPX. 70 if you want. No problem, man. 70 if you want it. I think that's it, guys, man. Now, I do like this shoe. I'm an Air Max one guy. It's like one of my favorite silhouette, and I love this uh, Ossidian or Navy Blue Midnight Navy colorway. But unfortunately, I do not have my size. I actually don't like the price, but I do like the shoe, man. So, um, it's been hard decisions to actually have my size. And I have seen a lot of these shoes appear in the Nike outlet over the past few weeks. Different colors. Um, all of them has been the Air Max 1, the LV8. But you got the additional sleuth on the toe box. So, I have been seeing them in so many different outlets and so many different colors, man. Tampa, I saw the maroon joints. Um, Violin, I saw the orange joints. Now here, I'm seeing the navy joints. So, I guess uh, anticipate these pulling up in your outlets soon. Well, 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 look what we have here. I was just about to leave and I saw these joints. These are the Air Jordan 3 denim joints. Now, I did buy myself a pair when the first release from Finish Line in the Florida Mall. I have not rocked my pair yet, but it's dope to see a, a retro in the building. Now, clearly, it's just going for retail, so I don't expect to, to find a full size run of these joints. Yep, 200 is the price. Well, that's cool to see, though, man. You don't get to see much retros in the building. Yo, peep it, yeah. We got the LeBron 17 joints. What the? We saw this in the Nike outlet violin. A few weeks back. That has small sizes. Has small sizes here as well. Dope shoe, man. I wish they had my size, man. I also saw these in like uh, Tampa as well, man. So it looks like there's a lot of places getting these shoes, but just small sizes. I guess the small size is not the move, which used to be the opposite, right? It used to be small sizes always sell out. Now, not so much for basketball shoes. And it's very slim on what they have here, man, as far as like retros. You're not seeing much retros in like the outlets anymore. But this is one retro I do have. Definitely didn't play that price. But they got a slew of them though, man. 165 is the price if y'all care for them. And they come with the box. Two size 12s, a lot of 13s. Yep, 165. Y'all see it. So I'm in the women's right now. And they also got some Air Jordan 34s, y'all. The low joints. But they're hitting a lot cheaper though. It's going for 100. They got a few sizes left. Size 6.5, wide, 5 wide. And also got the 35 as well. 400 beans full size running those it is what it is not much popping i'm about to get out of here okay this is youth pair these are the prestos mc i like that colorway and this is the air max plus gs oh these are dope too as well these are fire <laughs> 104 and we're back in the sneaker room man thank you if you made it this far man salute to all y'all but anyways nike celebration was pretty dope i like it i like the fact that I haven't seen that many retro Jordans in the building. Well, not essentially retro Jordans. There was a three, which I found in the hash ball, but that was in for retail, the Air Jordan 3 denims. But it also had the new innovations of the Air Jordans, like the 34s and the 35. They had two pairs of 34 lows, and they have one pair of the 35, regular 35. I don't think they made a, a low just yet. But anyways, that's that was good to see. And I ain't gonna hold y'all. I'm gonna show you what I picked up. You probably seen the last video. Her. Second to last video. Or these joints. Now, I told you I bought my wife a pair of Air Jordan um, Vapor Max outsole, like the Neon Vapor Max, but she said it was too tight. It was a nine and a half. Now, I bought these Air Max 200, same size, and she said it fits good. Go figure. Now, obviously, it's a different silhouette, but I like these colors, man. The more I look at them, I'm like, damn, I wish I got a pair of these. I like this black and white Air Max 200. If y'all know, I know the Air Max 200 is like, 
pretty much flooded throughout multiple different outlets. This is my Air Max 200 all red joints. Cop this last year, 2020. And I think I paid like around $53 for this. I kind of tricked it out. Like I said, I kind of um, colored the swoosh on the lateral side and also on the toe box region. And I also did on the other pair like the Air. But anyways, rock these a handful of times. Great price, comfortable shoe. And now I'm thinking of it, I'm kind of regret not buying more, man. Teach your zone, they're all throughout the outlets. Pick up a pair if you guys care to. And that's all I got for you guys, man. So stay tuned to the next outlet video. Also, I'm gonna be dropping the next uh, throwback outlet four. I did the Clarence store. I think I did, was it two Clarence stores and also took it to Tampa. Uh, I'm not sure where I'm gonna go in this video. Maybe I might take it to Gainesville. You already know I've been to so many different Nike outlets, man. So I'm gonna kind of switch it out here and there. But anyways, thanks for watching. If you're new to this channel and like what you just saw, hit that like, hit that subscribe, hit that notification bell as well. And everyone, leave your comments down below and your boy get back to you as soon as possible. Until then, until we meet again, you already know my slogan. Good to go. So wrap. Peace.